Hello, blessed souls. How y'all doing? If you're new here, welcome. I'm Brainy, and this is Brainy Twin Gemini. If you're returning sub, welcome back. Love to have you as part of our soul tribe and loving vibe. First and foremost, I want to thank you all so much for your beautiful donations, your love, your likes, your comments. It really touches my heart from the bottom of my heart, and I appreciate um, you all so very, very much. A little bit, bit about me and this channel. I believe to be on a twin soul, twin flame journey. I brushed shoulders with my twin for a good couple of decades. I want to say a good 20, couple of 20, well, I want to say 20 years. We were at the same music venues, went to the same college, lived on the same street, but we never actually acknowledged each other in the physical world until 2019. Um, we came into each other. Our love was just pure, vulnerable, raw, explosive. It's sometimes even hard to articulate into words. It wasn't so sustainable at that time. So we just went on our separate ways, completed our healing work, learning our lessons, clearing karma, and completing um, the awakening process. I'm merely just a messenger here on this journey in hopes to guide you to the truth of what this journey entails and guide you to the light of oneself and ultimately to each other. I was pushed in 2019 to start this channel. To be quite honest, I'm not even a YouTuber. I don't even look at YouTube, never have. And to this day, I still don't. <laughs> I know it seems strange, doesn't it? Um, yeah, so um, for all the American viewers out there, I wish you a deep, heartfelt, Happy Thanksgiving, and just to remind you, there's so much to be thankful for. This journey is a very difficult journey, but you were selected for a reason, and that's because uh, I feel the God, universe, source, however you resonate, felt that you could um, endure the rigor of this sometimes very debilitating soul journey. So happy Thanksgiving to you. I hope you have a beautiful, blessed day. And again, thank you all so much. And so I'm going to get started with a message here. I'm sure that's what you're waiting for. So um, this masculine is, you know, completely transforming, swift, shifted gears, lanes, however, you know, however you resonate. Realizing that not everything will resonate with this message. So just pack away what doesn't, keep what does. Um, they're on, <clears throat> sorry, I still have this clearing thing going on and you may as well. I don't know, but I feel like some of you may have some uh, tooth pain on the left side. I don't know why this stuff comes out. Um, they're on the journey to self-love. And it, it, I, find, I, I feel like this is the, the final destination of the journey, is to come to that purest form of self-love. And that's removing um, the trauma, removing any interference, and to truly have that love of yourself that has been denied for so long. Um, so they're getting to that destination. Their create their creativity is peaking. I feel like, and I felt like this for a few days. This energy, this beautiful energy, this this masculine just energy or counterpart, however you resonate, is writing songs, poetry, um, lyrics about you, because you are their greatest inspira inspiration in life. They've come to realize what you are to them, and you you know you inspired and have always inspired them to be a better person um they believe it or not um are sending you signs and synchronicities some very obscure signs and sinks so if you're seeing something out of the norm that is your masculine energy sending you um they're asking the universe god source divine however you resonate to send you something very significant and meaningful in terms of a sign and a sink they want to take action they are desperate to take action um, and they're articulating a plan on how they can come to you. They're out in nature and they're getting all sorts of beautiful downloads and confirmations and affirmations of the, the feelings that they feel for you are truly, truly real. So it is a, such a beautiful message. Um, your masculine or your counterpart is an incredible healer. And so are you, feminine energy. You are, I want to say, the healer of ages. You come in and you invoke that awakening, but you also invoke that healing. Um, and I, f I feel like 
only the two of you could do that for each other. Um, and it, it, is, it is a very, very grueling journey to get to the other side, to get to the light, because you have to go through so much. Um, you know, so much tears and just unknowns and confusion. But when you get to that light and that self-love, nothing can take that away from you. So you have been selected to embark on a very important journey. So always look at that uh, as, 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 you know, it being a, a gift and a blessing. Sometimes we may look at it as a curse because it seems as though when you're going through the journey, there's a lot more darkness than there is light. But just trust and believe. Um, another thing is, is um, this, this masculine is kind of daydreaming about having this beautiful, harmonious, happy family with you. Marriage, um, children, or being a mentor to the children that you already have in your life. They want to make a difference. Um, and they're just, you know, there's just have these beautiful visions of this family, um, this happy family, this harmonious family. Um, it's so, so beautiful. One thing is a couple of things. I can't always be the bearer of good news <laughs> because I'm the truth. I speak the truth, I speak from the heart. And, um, you know, as I said, this, this journey is about trials and tribulations. It's a roller coaster ride of emotions. It is not a fairy tale love story. It truly, truly isn't. Some of you may, throughout the journey, just give up, abolish it, lose your faith, and move on. It's entirely up to you what you do. You're never ever meant to be a prisoner in this, in this connection. You're meant to, meant to shine and be the best version of yourself, absolutely. And if you're not, then maybe this isn't for you at this time because you, you, you meant, you're meant to help and love each other unconditionally to get to the finish line of self-love. And that masculine is running. I want to say just running to that finish line right now. Um, if they could say anything to you right now, what would it be? And a few things. Um, I, want, I, I plan on taking action soon. Um, I'm peeling away the layers of my false self. Very, very important. That's how you get to that, that pure, I want to say raw, authentic, true self. When you start peeling those layers away. Um, they also are asking for a little bit of patience. Um, please be patient with me. I'm healing child wounds. This is a, a, such a fundamental element of this journey, is healing those inner childhood wounds. And what happens sometimes is these children, these inner ch children in, within us, they misbehave. Um, they act out. They get angry. They're looking for love, acceptance. Some, some of these masculines have been through severe trauma and they have to overcome this. And the reason why they have to overcome this is because you don't want to be in the dark shadows of their past. And what does that mean? Things get said, things get done. And that, you know, this, this bitterness and this anger that comes from this misbehaved inner child comes out in varying different forms. It can come out in, in addiction, abuse, all sorts of things, but it's not the, that's not how the journey is, is meant to, to go. So if you were to stay together in the third dimensional world and not go do your healing work, um, there could be irrevocable damage done. And that's that inner child pulling these temper tantrums. So know that this work has to be done. And there may be things that have already been said and done. And it's really put a strain on your, I want to say, confidence and faith in this connection. Just know that it's that inner child misbehaving. So the one good thing about the masculine is they're acknowledging that. They've, when they peel away these false layers, they come to this, to this, this I want to say, layer of this inner child. And they're getting to know it, this inner child intimately and acknowledging it and realizing that, <clears throat> I'm so sorry folks, some of the, some of the 
poor decision making stems from this inner child and not acknowledging. The first thing to do is write it down, acknowledge, and then realize that much of the things that happened were not your fault and just forgive and overcome. Very, very important feminine energy. Um, and uh, I'm not sure if I said this already, but they think you're a god, goddess. Absolutely. Um, there has been such divine protection um, f for, for this Twin Flame Collective. I want to say always, but more so lately. I'm not sure why. Maybe because some of you are in a dark place. But this masculine loves you. And they know that you came into their life to do so much. They're not going to come back to you until they're pure. And you're not meant to come back to them until um, you're pure. And this purification is taking place in like crazy, 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 crazy. Um, all sorts of, I know it seems strange, but I'm, I have to say it, bodily fluids. Clear though. It's clear. And it's that purification process. So as much as it's uncomfortable, you're pur pur purifying yourself and you're simultaneously energetically purifying each other. And most importantly, the world. What a beautiful gift, right? You, um, your essence, your energy essence is purifying the, the most beautiful love of oneself. But what you do for this earth is, I can't even describe in words. So kudos to you. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And um, lastly, I love you to infinity. There is no end to this love. This love, um, you know, stems far greater than the physical realm and you know this um, and your counterpart knows this your twin knows this your divine masculine um, this is this is beautiful it's at the soul level and not too many people get to experience this in this lifetime um, so beautiful beautiful messages two more beautiful messages for your beautiful loving souls and they are Two hearts merge through an explosion of love. United, they created unlimited wealth. Together, they fulfill their dreams. As this can be more fitting, this masculine is dreaming about a beautiful life with you. Um, and un, un, united, um, they, you create unlimited wealth. I put a quote yesterday. That's my quote, and it is absolutely true. Your worth is measured by how big your bank account is it's how big your heart is and together you have the, the i want to say trillions <laughs> um because of the love and the gifts and the miracles that have been presented to you um and another beautiful message for you is a loving thought triggers a loving response your love is felt and appreciated an angel surrounds you a sacred union is born, the union of two twin souls within a threefold flame. And I love this music, or music. <laughs> I don't know why music came out, Moody. Music is, uh, is, is meaningful to you today. Um, I love this message because for two reasons. Um, a loving thought triggers a loving response, and that's exactly it. And an angel surrounds you this i can't run from this stuff nor do i want to run from it these are beautiful sacred messages for you i'm so glad that you've stumbled onto this channel it it you know there's not very many subscribers on this channel and it's i always say it's not the quantity it's the quality and slow and steady wins the race so thank you i'm glad you came here today um and as many of you know, signs and synchronicities um, are a very, I want to say, important part of this journey. Y you end up at places that, you know, the, at the divine time, divine doors open. Um, you, you're, you just get these crazy signs and sinks. I, I'm not going to sugarcoat. Um, you're more aware of it because you're awakened to it now. And there are going to be, as I said earlier in this message, some significant signs and synchronicities. They're coming right from your masculine energy because they're asking for signs and things 
to, from, from God, source, uh, to, to validate that the, what they feel for you is true and what you feel for them is true. And as a result, you're going to receive something significant as well. They do ask for the same things you do, believe it or not. Um, so they're asking and they're asking for something to be something beautiful to be sent to you And as I said, they're articulating action, but um, I believe in animals so much. There's such beautiful beautiful Creatures and we're so blessed to have them on this earth and they come to us at the most divine perfect time um, There may be something that really resonates with you in your journey. Mine was a hawk um, and doves and they were there every single day every freaking day I saw them but today's animal spirit message for the feminine is peacock spirit let it shine and that to me totally resonates with god goddess and one of these things um, to get to self-love is what i used to say and i still continue to say in my journal and um, meditate i am a god goddess and i shall um, i deserve to be treated as such um, you know, and you're inviting that love into your life, believe it or not, shine. You already are a, a shining light. You shine so bright um, that you need sunglasses. <laughs> Sorry, I had to say that, it just came out. Um, so let it shine, stand in your power and be the beautiful version you are. And for masculine, uh, animal spirit message, it is dream the world into being. So dreams, 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 um, very, very, um, I want to say important or relevant energy for the masculine. They, they're daydreaming, they're dreaming of a happy family, you know, um, they're manifesting, um, together you fulfill your dreams. And so, yes, they are dreaming in manifesting your love into being in the physical world how beautiful is that and the overall energy animal energy message is life is a mystery this journey is a mystery sometimes you don't always have the answers to the questions that you have and you just have to accept you know um, life truly is a mystery <laughs> we don't have all the answers um, as we walk f forward in our journey we just have to accept that there are certain mysteries that will reveal themselves in due time so that's what i have for you beautiful loving souls today if any of this resonates kindly hit the subscribe for more videos like this as i said i'm always working on stuff um, behind the scenes so like and comment love your comments always consider a small donation it truly really, really does help um, it really goes back into the channel um, and you know so I can bring some beautiful beautiful videos to you there's one video on landscapes um, beautiful land, uh, world landscapes honestly watch it it gives you just this immediate sense of peace um, just looking at the beauty of the world um, that we live in and that is what I have for your beautiful souls so again to all the American folks out there, have a beautiful, blessed Thanksgiving. Have a great day, folks.